Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Panini Absolute Baseball 10 box random team break number one. All cards ship, all teams in, boys and girls. It says right there. Big thanks to these folks for getting into the action. Appreciate the people who bought their spots straight up. And thanks and uh, congrats again to the people who uh, won their spots in that blaster box break. All teams are in. Let's roll it. Let's randomize it. Three and a five, eight times for each list. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And eighth and final time. After eight, we've got Robert down to Brandon Richards. All right. Three and a five, eight times. Good luck with the teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And eighth and final time. After eight times, there we go. Reds down to the Strohs. Remember during the Red Scare of the 60s, the Reds temporarily changed their name to the Red Legs because they didn't want to be associated with those communists? It was a thing that happened. Robert with the Red Legs, Anthony with the Athletics, John with the Bravos, David, you got my Dodgers. Am I wearing Dodgers? Hate Dodgers. Mike Cody with the Cardinals, Chris Miller with the Mets, David with the Gigantes, Nicholas with the Bronx Bombers. I guess Metropolitans would be their nickname, right? Cardinals, Bronx Bombers, Blue. I guess Blue Jays don't really, I guess just shorten it to Jays. Halos for Ryan H. Nick with the, uh, I think Twinkies is what we get out of there. Uh, Curtis with the Snakes, Ryan H. with the Nats. Barry with the Tribe. We got a Royals nickname? Donnie with the Royals. The Roy Roy's? Royals? Mark with the Cubbies. Adam with the Fighting Phils. Jonathan with the Tigers, I guess. No nickname for the Rangers, right? Just Texas Rangers. Wes with the Red Sox. Bo Sox, I think we can go with that. SKS with the O's. Rick with the M's. Andy with the Rocks. Leonard with the Buckos. Rick with the Fish. Chris with the Shy Sox, Craig with the Rays. I guess Rays don't really have. Friars for Justin. Brew Crew for Patrick. And I guess just Strohs. Just kind of simplify Strohs. Strohs for Brandon Richards. There you go. Let's alphabetize this by team. Now, I did drop the checklist into the chat. I'll drop it again. I'll pause the video as well for just a few moments just to see if anybody wants to trade or get a good idea of what they, they can look for. All right, stick around. Be right back. All right, welcome back, folks. A little bit of trade chatter, but in the end, no deals were done here in the 10-box Ram Team number one with the brand new 2020 Panini Absolute Baseball. Just came out yesterday. Big thanks to all of these folks right here for getting into the action. On NBCSN, we got some some uh, open wheel racing happening here. We got some indie car racing here. Is that what it's called? Steering wheels look like it's a video game controller. That's wild. All right. So there's five boxes in the row on the back and five in the row on the front. What do we got here? Four autographs and two memorabilia cards per box on average. Teddy, are you still over there? Yeah, what's up? I'm sorry. Have, have you have you looked at no 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 have you looked at, uh, have you opened up any any of this absolute baseball yesterday? Yes. How's it look? Um, I got a really nice Robin Yao card. All right, all right. Um, I don't know. Well, let's see. Let's see what this full case has in store for us. People, people like that. I, I thought this would this would sell out faster. People were talking it up. Looks a little bit like leather and lumber from last year. Okay, okay. Well, Absolute's a pretty solid brand. Let's see what we got here. I think this is the first year they did. Abs this is first year for Absolute Baseball, if I'm not mistaken. I think it's pretty cool. Do we got base cards on the bottom here?
I could drive the pace car. I don't know if I would be able to drive the Indy car. All right, so there's Christian Yelich to 25. I like this absolute design right here. Keston Hira. Rizzo to 190. Remember, all cards ship, so everything you see will ship. Numbered cards, of course, will be top loaded. And here are your hits. Nice. I like the uh, the chevrons right here. There's Dylan Cease, rookie materials. These will all need 130s. All right, not numbered, but this will go to Chris Parent and the White Sox. We got Tools of the Trade, Luis Robert. Wow. Five out of 49, triple relic and autograph. Chris Parent, White Sox. Well, there's a good start. That is five out of 49 on that one. Got bat, jersey, and what? Piece of a, a sock, a sweatband, something like that. Those are the tools of his trade. That's pretty cool. And then we got Aaron Saval. Wow, nine out of 10. Yeah, I remember this design in leather and lumber, right? I, I like this design. No, that's not acceptable. Not, that top loader is not acceptable, ladies and gentlemen. This top loader, much better. Can't have that. Nine out of 10, Aaron Saval. That goes to Barry and the Indians. All right, Polanco right there. Let's see if we can maybe use a blank card to hide the hits right there. I think I get the pattern right there. All right, Hall bound, Miguel Cabrera. Piece of his uh, bat, six out of 25. Definitely hall bound, right? Is Miggy getting 3,000 hits, boys and girls? I think he's close. I think if he, if he sees out the, uh, if he sees out his entire contract, I think he will. Jonathan with that one. And we've got Logan Allen. Eight out of 75. Ooh, that's a wreck. Watch, I get out of the grass, bro. Ooh, what a save. We got Jersey Signatures, Joyzy, Joyzy Signatures, Logan Allen, Cleveland Indians, Barry Roberts, Mike Tower is asking, does Cleveland keep their name or change? I think they'll eventually have to change it. Anthony K, 107 out of 125. I mean, I think they might. I think I, I think I think they they had. They had kind of proactively, there's 107 out of 125, Anthony K, Blue Jays for Jacob Johnson. I think they've proactively already kind of started doing that, removing those big images of of uh, Chief Wahoo and all that. The Braves or the Chiefs? They might. They, they might not. Cleveland Spiders? Do, do they? Do they have? Do they have like a bunch of like spiders out there? A bunch of shelobs? Crawling around caves, trying to trying to get Frodo. If you're into that sort of thing, <laughs> there's introductions to '99. Fernando Tatis Jr. Oh, that was their old name. There's Josh Donaldson to ten. Uh, for the Twins, that will be for Nick. Oh, that's right. Josh Donaldson's on Twins. 
We got tools of the trade, David Fletcher. Quad relic to 99. That will go to Ryan H. And the Angels. In the arms of the angel. We got iconic ink, Fernando Tatis Jr. 80 out of 99 for the Friars, Justin Brandner. We got second year Fernando Tatis Jr. autograph, nice. There you go. All right. Next up, we've got Abraham Toro. 17 out of 125. Nice. That goes to the Strohs. Brandon Richards on the board. I want to move that autograph, like, right. I want to cut and then drag that right to the middle. Center that up, Abraham. All right, there's Mike Trout right there. And we've got Whit Merrifield to 199. Ooh, the mixer sold down, the baseball mixer, sorry. Which mixer are you talking about, Smokey? We've got a, we've got a few. Tools of the trade. We've got a quad relic and then a duel on the left side. 81 out of 99. That's a cool design. Aristides Aquino. Great player there. I hope he can keep keep it up. That'll be hashtag good for the hobby. Robert Runkle with that one. There's Logan Allen again at 61 out of 99. Joyzy signatures. Jersey and autograph. Oh, the basketball mixer. Nice. Did the mini break sell out too? Surely Smokey Brandon wouldn't say it was sold out until the mini break sold out. Barry Roberts with the Indians. Anthony K. Toronto Blue Jays. 3 out of 75. Bluebirds. Jacob Johnson. All right, next box. We need to get more topplers. Hang tight, folks. Stand by. Top loaders by Ultra Pro. Work on a Ultra Pro jingle, maybe. One thirty super thick top loaders by Ultra Pro. Ultra Pro, your one stop for protecting what you love. Sounds more like a gun ad. Um, Ultra Pro. What the pros use. Ultra Pro. You get like an athlete. You get an athlete to be like, maybe an athlete top loading a card. Ultra Pro. It's what the pros use. Good luck. Oh, good. Brandon was correct about it, it, it being full. Excellent. Good. Otherwise, otherwise, I would have given you the what for.
All right, Mike Tower was asking earlier, what would be hashtag bad for the hobby? Everything else. You know? I don't like to think about what's... I don't like to think about that stuff, though. That that takes me to a to a to a, a place of, of of darkness. Players becoming busts, getting busted for something. I don't know. I don't want to think about it. That's uh, there's Jordan Alvarez rookie materials going to Brandon Richards and the Astros. Not numbered, I don't think. There you go. Nice. There's Evan White, Absolute Inc. To 99 for the Seattle Mariners. Rick Serrano with the M's. Right, yeah, COVID's hashtag. Well, no, actually, I don't know. Mixed feelings on that. <laughs> Hobby wise, 39 out of 125, Dylan Cease. White Sox having a nice break. There you go, Chris Parent. On one hand, we don't have live sports. That's not good. Right? But on the other hand, more people have been staying at home, so more people are into the hobby now, which will help once live sports come. I don't All right, to 199, there's Jose Barrios. There's Jonathan Hernandez for Texas, 62 out of 99. I, there's a nice, uh, nice foil or sheen on top of these cards that I really dig. Dan with the Rangers. We got for the Giants, my rivals. Jalen Davis, 83 out of 140, Jersey Signatures. San Francisco, that will be David. Which actually maybe will be a little more comfortable in a 180 top loader. And back here is Nick Solak. I like the, I, I like those, uh, Autograph baseballs right there. 30 out of 125. Another one for Texas. And that will be for Dan. Nice. All right. Oh, good. Now we're getting some things sold out. Excellent. All right. I'll try to increase. Now that I'm kind of used to the format of this, we can... Got a good look at the design. We can increase the uh, speed on this. Get this into third gear. All these cards ship, so you'll get all this stuff, folks. That Jose Altuve for the Strohs. And your hits. We've got Donnie Walbert, Donnie Walton, rookie materials for Seattle. That will be for uh, Rick and the Mariners. We got Goose Gossage, iconic ink to 10. Part of the uh, all mustache team. I, I got to work on that. That page for the website, jaspiescasebreaks.com, the uh, the Jaspies official all mustache team. That goes to Anthony and the Oakland A's. And we've got Andres Munoz, 129 out of 149 for the Padres. Justin with the Friars. There you go. I like the design of this absolute this year, folks. It looks nice and clean. And then we've got Kevin Biggio, Craig's kid. It's 99 for the Bluebirds. And we've got Freddie Freeman, Acuna Jr. Dual Relic Team Tandem Materials. 
That'll be for John Viglin and the Atlanta Braves. Tools of the trade, triple relic and autograph, Jake Rogers, 14 out of 140. Detroit, Jonathan with the Tigers. Jake, Jake, Jake. Jake. Jakey. Dustin May. 33 out of 50. May Day. Dustin May for my Dodgers. That'll be for David. There you go. Walker Bueller, Dustin May. That could be that could be the tandem of the future, ladies and gentlemen. Dustin may have to pitch wearing a hairnet. No, that's that's some good show hair right there, Mike Tower. You can't you can't lock that up in a hairnet. No way. No way. Would you would you tell a uh, would you tell a tiger to cover up its stripes? Would you tell a peacock not to peacock? Would you tell Dustin May? To cover up that show hair, no way. That's some good show hair right there. Make myself some room on that side there. Tools of the trade. That's a good looking card. To twenty five, triple rally. Got a bit of the Mariners lettering in there. That's Donnie Walton for Rick. <laughs> right, yeah. After a few months of sheltering in place, Dustin May's, May's hair is probably wild. As it should be. There's Victor Robles. Nice. Two out of ten. Three color patch and autographed jersey signatures. Nationals. That Victor Robles hasn't even reached his final form. I think he can still evolve, Ryan H. We got Sam Hilliard to 125 for the Rocks. That will be for Andy Owens and the Rockies. Well, my barber shops are open for like, I think there's, I think barber shops still still might be open. It's been open for a few weeks. He might have been able to, might have been able to tame the main. All right, there's David Dahl. And rookie roundup, we've got Shun Yamaguchi for the Blue Jays. All right, Tatis Jr., grip it and rip it. That's what it says. Dual relic for the Padres. Goes nicely without autograph, Justin. We've got dual relic and autograph to uh, 132. That's T Tyron Taylor. Tyron Taylor? Tyron Taylor? Terrell, De Terrell Owens. Looks like a piece of a batting glove maybe down there. Does it say on the back? No, it, do it doesn't, but it looks like a p it might be a piece of a glove. Brew Crew, Patrick with the Brewers. And we got Nico Horner, 53 out of 99, rookie autograph. Cubs fans have high hopes for him. That goes to Mark L. Leonard, what's up? Uh, you got the Pirates. I don't think we've called out the Pirates number yet. But we still have half the case to go.
Do you have another team, maybe? No? Just one? Yeah, just that one. All right, good luck, everybody. Here we go. Next one. There's introduction, Jordan Alvarez. Nice. To 199, Chris Paddock. Tools of the trade, Jeff McNeil. 87 out of 99. That's six pieces right here. He might, he might win a batting title someday, ladies and gents. Chris Miller with the Mets. We got Bobby Bradley, rookie auto to 99 for Cleveland. Barry Roberts. And we've got Justin Dunn, 90 out of 99. Dun, 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 dun. That'll go to Rick Serrano. I feel like that should be his, his strikeout song when he strikes someone out. Be like, dun, 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 dun. That's it. If I was in Seattle, that's what I would do. If I was running that soundboard. Luis Robert, introductions to 99. And then we've got Garrett Cole to 199. We got Gavin Lux. It's my guy right there. Rookie materials. Dodgers. David. Second base has been a bit of a black hole for the Dodgers for a number of years. He might, he might fill that void. Tools of the trade. Triple relic and autograph. Uh, Adbert Alzole. 36 out of 99. Another uh, highly touted prospect for the Cubs. Going to Mark. So you got Nico Horner and you've got the triple relic auto. Adbert Alzole. For Mark, there you go. And down here, Jonathan Daza, 83 out of 125 for the Rocks. Andy Owens with the Rockies won that won that team in the team random. All right, four box to go. Thanks for getting in, everybody. We've got another case up in the store. Uh, random team two. I don't think no uh, no filler or anything like that for it just yet. So grab your spots while they are still available straight up. And we can rock through another case of this. I did, I did take my time on this one a little bit just because it's our first look at it. I don't want to speed through it, but we should be able to do the next one a little bit more quicker than this. And remember, all cards ship. Okay. Do safe drivers really save 40%? Absolute legend, Harmon Killebrew. And there's DJ LeMayhew. He might still win another batting title someday. Some say that Killebrew is the MLB logo. Gavin Lux, there he is, 63 out of 99. Piece of his lumber in there too. That'll be for David Liu and the Dodgers. Jersey and autograph, Justin Dunn, 84 out of 99. Nice, another one for Rick Serrano. And there's Jonathan Diaz, or Daza, that is. 61 out of 125. Andy with the Rockies. Starting your Jonathan Daza PC. All right, there's Nick Senzel for the Reds. Reds have a good young crop of players coming up together. There's Shun Yamaguchi for Toronto. That will be for Jacob. 
There's tools of the trade, triple relic and autograph. That's Bruce Dar Graterall. Nice for the Dodgers to 75. Might fill in the uh, that middle relief. That's the Dodgers really need. Not really need, but could use. Kenley Jans is not getting any younger. Either. And one out of five, Jordan Hicks. Nice. Cardinals. Mike Cody with the first train whistle of the break. I like that the lacing is is green. Are all the out of fives green? All aboard the Big Hit Express. Whoop whoop. Nice. Next box. Next two mini boxes. Ninety-nine. We got Jim Palmer. And then we got Pete Alonzo to one ninety-nine. We got ooh, nice grip it and rip it, Jordan Alvarez. Yeah, that's definitely a piece of the glove. Maybe a piece of the Astro star right there. Eight out of ten for this uh, this slugger. Nice one for Brandon Richards in the Astros. This guy didn't cheat. He's cool. He's cool. We've got jersey and autograph Jalen Davis to 75. Giants, David, with Jalen. And there's another Adbert Alzale autograph. You got to shift that auto right, right, right over. 69, nice. Out of 149, Mark, Cubs. Absolute heroes to 99. And then we've got uh, Freddie Freeman right there as well. Let's we'll see those a little bit later. Aaron Saval, rookie materials, 79 out of 99 for Cleveland. Barry Roberts. We've got absolute heroes, jersey and autograph. Adrian Beltre, 23 out of 25. Nice. Rangers, that goes to Dan. Is this Hall of Famer Adrian Beltre? Absolutely. First ballot? Yeah, I think I think so. I think maybe second or third year. And there's TJ Zook. There you go, making good use of the canvas right here, TJ. Nice, 46 out of 125. All right, two more boxes to go, folks. Almost there, stay on target. Almost there. Uh, BJ Jordan, wasn't he, who, part of the cheating stuff? If so, does that hurt him? Are you talking about Jordan, maybe? I don't think, yeah, Jordan Alvarez wasn't even... Uh, oh, Beltre? Yeah, I think Beltre was linked to some sort of PED thing for a split second, right? But I feel like there wasn't like, I don't know, kind of avoided a lot of criticism for that for some reason. I remember he like smacked like 48 home runs, something like that, for the almost 50 home runs for the Dodgers his free agent year. And they were eyebrows raised. 
And then he got paid by by the Mariners. It didn't really pan out there. Ooh, this is nice. Patrick Wisdom. And then ended up on the Rangers. Just like Patrick Wisdom to 49 for Dan in Texas. That's a great quad relic right there. Or I'm sorry, Seattle. Wasn't Patrick Wisdom on the... Can I think of someone else? Mariners. Sorry, Rick Serrano with that one. And here is Kevin Biggio. That's an excellent card there too. To 199, Kevin Biggio for the Blue Jays, Jacob Johnson. And Matt Tice to 125 for the Angels, Ryan H. And there's Keston here at a 10. It's a 10. Let me protect that really quick. All right. Greg Maddox, Absolute Heroes. Two pieces of his lumber. Nice. 29 out 25. Might not see pitchers hit again. Sooner rather than later. There's Randy Arozarena. That is to 125. That is for Tampa Bay. Craig McGinnis with the Tampa Bay Rays. <coughs> Excuse me. Throat's drying up here. Bo Bichette. I'm not sure if I'll be able to make it through the day. Nice Bo Bichette. Yeah. Arthur, when did Patrick Wisdom go to Seattle? we got to look that up. Nice Boba Shett. Blue Jays having a nice break. Got the Kevin Biggios in there and everything, too. He's, oh, he was a free agent? Signed with the Mariners on November 27th. Hmm. Interesting. I thought he was... I thought he was in... The Rangers' plans, but apparently not. All right, last box, boys and girls. No idea, Rory. We'll find out, though. How many did we do yesterday for Chronicles? One or two? This DJ Khaled commercial cracks me up so much. Put in that work, Devin. Don't give up. There's Keston here at a 199. Nice. Just got to cut down on that strikeout rate, Keston here, but if he does, he'll be great. Albert Pools, haul bound for sure. That goes to the Angels, Ryan H. We've got Donnie Walton to 99. That will be for the Mariners. That's going to go to Rick. And Gavin Lux. Nice autograph baseball right there. 31 out of 149. David with the Dodgers. All right, there's Walker Bueller to 199. And a few more here. We got Kevin Kramer. 99 out of 99. Newman's on the Pirates, too, ladies and gentlemen. That goes to Leonard. There you go, Leonard, on the board. We've got Max Muncy. 97 out of 99. Guy reconstructed his swing from the ground up. 
revived his career. It's like almost like a Justin Turner type story. We got Domingo Leyba, 83 out of 99. Arizona Diamondbacks, Curtis on the board with an auto at the very, very, very end. There you go, Curtis. Something for you. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That's it. Nice break. That was 10 box Ram Team 1 of the brand new 2020 Panini Absolute Baseball. We've got some more in the store, so check it out, and I'll break that with you next time. Bye-bye.